Welcome to my channel good people Today I want to show you how to download Sentinel 2 images from Land Viewer. I have to tell you that uh, the first thing that you have to do is to create an account with Land Viewer. It is for free. You can use your Gmail, your LinkedIn or your Facebook. So, let's get to it. Harakasha Land Viewer. Search for that. So, when you get to Land Viewer, you go to this icon here. Uh, so if you are new to learn viewer you have to sign up you have to create an account you can create a, put your first name put your last name put your email uh, fill up all these uh, fields and then sign up if you already have an account like me then you just have to sign in put in your email address and then it so when you get to learn viewer when you log in to learn viewer uh, the first thing that you have to, to do is to locate your area in London. If you want to download the Harare for Harare, then you have to locate Harare in Zimbabwe. So, there are many ways you can do this. The first thing is to enter the location, the name of the area where you want to download your image. If you want to download an image for Harare, then just search for Harare. It will take you to Harare, uh, Zimbabwe. Okay. If you're interested in another area, Blawayo, you just have to put the name of your, uh, the location, the name of your location. Or, optionally, you can put, paste the coordinates of the area where you want to download your image, or the scene ID. Another way is to drag your map. Drag your map until you find the area where you want to download your image. For instance, I want to download an image for this area. And I, when I locate it, I come here to draw a rectangular AOI. This is my area of interest. You can save it if you want. Or you can draw a polygonal area of interest. Close it by pressing and clicking on the first on top of the first point that you created. Or you can create a circular AOI. There it is. You can save it if you want. Okay. Uh, so use uh, how to use on, on how I won't get much on on the other elements of Land Viewer because I just want to show you how to download uh, a Sentinel to image. Then what you have to do is to go to search settings. This is where you define your filters like the dates, the date range, your cloud cover. Um, and the type of sensor that you're interested in. So here you have passive sensors, passive sensors, night, passive sensors, low resolution, active sensors. Some of these you have you can use them when you have subscribed, you've paid something to learn viewer. But for we will you will use passive sensors day. But then you enter date 20, 20, uh, 06, 01. Okay, when you select, as you can see, there, there, are, there are images that have got a lot of clouds, and they are so to to define uh, the cloudliness that you want to tolerate, you have to drag this to, to adjust cloudliness. To the percentage that you want to tolerate for instance if i want to tolerate zero to fifty percent i'll adjust it to fifty percent so if i want zero percent there are also images that have got zero percent as you can see okay sun ele elevation i have never used this one then as you can see here we have this is lens at seven this is lens at sentinel two uh, this is lens at eight so there are different sensors they are differently what you uh, ideally what you want to you would want to do here is to choose the exact sensor that you are interested in so you unclick on all sensors bah, and then you select if you want sentinel 2 only sentinel 2 images will appear here as you can see if you're interested in uh lens at seven lens at eight only Lancet 8 will appear. If you are interested in Lancet 7, 
only less than seven will appear here okay so for this case in this case we are interested in sentinel 2 let's go then here mosaic scenes i will advise you that every time when you want to download an image you make sure this is adjusted to scenes okay here are our images uh, to close this just press there so that you can see your area of interest so you want you may want to see whether these images cover your area of interest or not so that you can be able to choose which image is ideal for your uh, for your purpose so to do that you have to hover on top of the image just move on top of the image don't click on it as you click on it you're gonna exhaust all the free scenes you are entitled to here because you only have 10 free scenes that you can click on top of so in this case you just have to hover you just have to to move on top of your image as you can see when i move uh, it shows me uh, uh, the area covered by this image uh, it shows me the area covered by this image as you can see area covered by this image it covers a part of my image and so forth and so forth so that's how you see if you want to see whether the appearance of your image like what we call a quick look image or a natural uh, color band combination you can just click on top of your image if you click on top of it it's gonna appear there the image is going to appear here there is our image it's a natural color image as you can see you can see uh, how your water appears lot of algae you can see a lot of things you can see uh, our rivers and so forth so in our small towns yeah so you click on top of it to download this image if you are in if you are satisfied with it to download it you go to scene downloading there this icon here bah. okay then here there is visual analytic and indices uh, if you the visual is this one that you are seeing there uh, the, the quick look image so if you want to download this quick look image you can just download it as a jpeg whatsoever if you're interested in in the indices you can also come here visualize your ntvi uh, if you want to download your ntvi you can come here you can if you want to download your survey your arv your av your EGC, hci your, uh, your pen ratio your no, no, normalized difference water index snow index scene classification and so forth but here we are interested in downloading the images the pens so you have to go to analytic uh, when you go to analytic they are almost I think it's 13 pens so as you can see we've got coastal pens blue whatsoever whatsoever so ideally uh, if you want optionally you can download all the pens but this is going to take a lot of your time and a lot of your data so it depends on what you want to do if you want to do a maybe an ntv analysis a normalized difference vegetation index then you have to download just uh band four the red band and our band eight the near infrared band these are the pens that we use to calculate our ntvi or if you are interested in the in the ntvi you can then download the green and the our near infrared so it depends on what you want to do but make sure that when you choose these bands make sure you choose this product metadata because you will need this to to do your image pre-processing like if you're doing an image pre-processing you require this product metadata okay 
then you go to match bands with the same resolution remember that sentinel 2 in in the visible range uh, those bands in the visible range have a similar resolution a very high uh, high res resolution uh, which is similar so th those bands in the uh, visible range they will be combined into meshed into one band so it's something that you want to avoid so make sure every time you unclick on merge pens with the same resolution you may ideally you may want to download the whole image so the whole scene so just uh, unclick on crop but if you want to crop maybe uh, download some like you want to download uh, this part only this you do to save time because if you are focused on this only then there's no need to download the whole scene as you can see how big this scene is uh, while you are focused only on maybe you just want to download uh, only this so sometimes there's no need to download the whole scene you ch can just crop this uh, this is the that is that that is the purpose of using crop image so if you crop I would advise you not to when you're beginning if you're a beginner don't don't crop because sometimes you can you can forget to adjust this cropping area so it can give you a lot of problems but if you are used to it you can crop to reduce cost and time and so forth so after you adjust all this then you can press download ba -ba -ba. processing it will take some time to inspect your progress terms of downloading go to these three buttons additional tools download manager you can see the progress of your download uh, it's gonna take four minutes five minutes around there two minutes changing so it depends on depends on the speed of your internet and so forth so that's it guys next time my next video will show you how to use land viewer to do your time series analysis without even having to download the images just doing your time series analysis for on ntvi uh, how you can visualize your image how you can create an ntvi here how you can create all those other indices here how you can do all the other band combinations here without having to download the all the bands you can do all these things here and then download the 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 index that you are interested in so my next video will show you that thank you so much guys thank you for watching my video make sure you subscribe please Bye.